Hey everyone, Mike Scan here, Senior Pastor of Epic Life Church in Terrell, Texas. Welcome to our Three Minute Thursday, where we take three minutes or less and look at topics and subjects of the Bible and try to explain it just a little bit in real simple form. Today, we're going to look at our Savior. Is His name Jesus or is His name Yeshua? Let's unpack this. Matter of fact, the thing about Jesus is interesting, is that Jesus is a relatively new name. It's less than 400 years old. Jesus is a translation of a translation. In other words, they didn't, in the Greek, they could not translate Yeshua, which is his Hebrew original name, into what we know as Jesus today. And they had to kind of create a word. They had to create a name to mean the name Jesus. And so Jesus is a translation from the Greek, into the Latin, into the English, where we get today the name Jesus. And his last name is not Christ. You might not have known this. And big surprise, there is no middle letter for Jesus, okay? Christ means anointed one, or in the Greek, it's Christo, uh, and it means anointed one. In the uh, uh, Hebrew, it's Yeshua Hamashiach, which means Messiah, or actually anointed one as well. Jesus is the Hebrew name for Yeshua. Matter of fact, it is what his mom would have called him. His mom would have called him Yeshua. Yeshua comes from the uh, Aramaic form of a Hebrew name, Joshua, and uh, anointed one and king. So Yeshua, by definition, that's what I love about it, the definition for Yeshua, the Hebrew name of Jesus, is salvation. Or some believe the greater word is deliverer, that Yeshua means deliverer and salvation. Now, here's why this is important. Because in Matthew chapter 1, verse 21, I want to read this to you because it's talking about the prof prophecy of Jesus and when he's going to come and what his name will be. And in verse 21, it says, and she will give birth to a son and you will call his name Yeshua. Why? Read the rest of the verse. For he will save his people. So the angel tells Mary what the name of Yeshua is going to be because in his name is the name salvation. And that's what it says. It says, you will name him Yeshua for he will save his people. And so that's why we use the name Yeshua. So here's the thing that's really important. The, a question that I get asked is, should we call him Jesus or should we call him Yeshua? And I wanna finish with an illustration. My name is Michael. Michael means, um, uh, it means who is like the Lord. But people don't come in and go, who is like the Lord, right? Now, if you just met me and called me Bob, because Bob was easier for you to say instead of Michael, after a while, I'd be a little upset. I'd be like, you know, hey, my name is Michael. That's what my mom called me. Why won't you call me Michael? But because of translation, we kind of missed around with, should we call him Jesus or should we call him Yeshua? I've even heard people say, I'm not calling him Yeshua because that's not who Jesus is. But in actuality, it is. Yeshua and Jesus are the same people. They're not different. Here's what we need to know, is that in the Bible, names have meanings. But if you choose to call Jesus, Jesus, instead of Yeshua, that's not going to offend me. I don't think it even offends God. I think God knows who we're referring to because of English and the lateral and the Greek and all that stuff, translation. But it does not bother me and it shouldn't bother you either. Um, I know who you're talking about and I believe God does as well. This has been our three minute Thursday on the name Jesus or Yeshua. But in Yeshua's name, I bless you. Have a great day. We'll see you next time.